Hello everybody, it is your boy Shannon Man coming at you again with a brand new GTA 5 Unlimited Money Glitch and I hope you guys enjoy this video. Guys, let's get into this glitch. Alright guys, so the first thing you want to do is load up the mission, It Takes a Thief. I'm going to be doing this one with my buddy Asher, but this does work solo as well, so be sure to load up this specific mission, and then let's go ahead and continue. Alright guys, so once you have loaded up the mission, you need to go ahead and hop into your vehicle of choice. And the mission here guys is to capture two separate vehicles and that's why it may work better if you use a friend. But you can do this solo as well. So what you want to do is make your way over to the dot, the blue dots on your mini map, one at a time. And you want to go ahead and grab the cars as you see we're doing here. Now, what you want to do is make sure that you damage these cars as little as possible. However, some damage is going to happen because you are trying to actually kill the drivers. But that's okay because we're still going to make a boatload of cash off this message mission, no problem. So here you can see I stopped this person and I killed him. I get out of my car, hop into that vehicle. As you can see, I do right there. Now guys, I'm going to go ahead and bring up the map so you guys can see where we need to go for this specific glitch so that we can actually get this RP and money like we want. So I'm going to go ahead and pull that map up right now. We're going to want to make our way over to this ammunition store area as you can see. Now I'm going to go ahead and drive all the way over there. And when I get there guys, it really is just a waiting game until your friend gets his car and comes over to meet you. However, if he does not get his car, you can do this by yourself. You'll just need to do it at least one time and then find the other car on the map. But it works best with another person, so just remember that. But yeah, so we're making our way all the way over to that location on the map. And I'll show you what to do once we get there. Alright, so now we're over near the area that we need to be. The reason that we need to be over here is because we're actually going to be using a glitch that I used in one of the other videos, guys. So you need to make sure to push this trash can into place just like that. And then you need to park this other car that you have and your buddy needs to park his car over in the back corner as you see my buddy Asher has just done over there on the right hand side of your screen. Once you've done that, you need to go ahead and park the vehicle next to his and then hop out of the car and make your way back over towards the dumpster. Once you are near the dumpster, you need to position yourself just about right so you can actually climb up over the edge into the glitched out area. Once you have gotten into this glitched out area, it's time to start killing cops and destroying helicopters and doing whatever you can to get five stars on you. So you can see here I'm hopping up onto the trash can and then I hop up over the edge. It's really simple to do. And now we're just going to start blowing things up and killing cops till we get our five star rating. Now, once we have our five star rating, I will then be back and we'll continue the glitch. Just a real quick tip for you guys is to get to the five stars, it's usually best to shoot down some helicopters and you'll get that five star fairly fast as you see I just do right here. Now once you have your five star rating and your friend has his, you need to make your way over to an edge in this glitch until your stars start flashing. And your star should only flash for about 45 seconds to a minute. And then when they are done, it's time to jump off the edge into the gray area. And you will then respawn onto the map right near where you need to be. So as you guys can see here, we have gotten our stars and they are flashing. And they're about to fall off of us without even a problem at all. It doesn't matter if cops come around the side, they can't see you. So there you guys go, got the five stars off. Now we just need to make our way through our glitched out area here and we're gonna go ahead and then lose the cops once again really quick because we probably will get another star on us when you do this glitch after you've popped back in you just simply need to go back to the vehicle of choice that you have picked up and you need to go ahead and drive over to Simeon usually if this happens and the cops get back on you for hopping in the vehicle I just call up Lester and I make my way over to the dealership which as you can see is right down the road over here and then just deliver the vehicle and that's the end of the glitch guys and you guys are gonna get a ton of money in RP for this 
So be sure to hit that like button if you guys enjoyed it. And also, guys, if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe for more awesome GTA 5 money glitches coming your way soon. It's been your boy, Shannon Man, and that's all I have for you today. As you guys can see, we are making a boatload of cash from Simeon. We get several thousand dollars. That's right. In fact, we got exactly... Twenty grand, four thousand RP. I'm out. Peace.